Hi friends, I have a couple of little tidbits for you. If you're dealing with any kind of hip pain, back pain, um, or would like to prevent that, uh, do this next little bit with me. Um, so I'm gonna give you some cues that you can add to your everyday activities, your exercise, anything from you know cardio to yoga to weights, a couple of instructions. So come into this really high, easy lunge with me. So you can really feel this here. There you go. We have two hip bones. We're gonna pretend that we can squeeze them together. Ready, go. So you probably felt this. Now we're gonna squeeze front to back, tailbone and pubic bone. Imagine they can squeeze together, go. All right, so now we've added those two things. Now lift your pelvic floor, go. Now lifting your pelvic floor, if you're not familiar with it, is like pretending that you're peeing. You have to stop the stream of pee. So squeeze in one more time, squeeze in front to back, and lift that pelvic floor. Excellent. Bring your feet together, or regular. <laughs> now pretend you're going to lift a heavy box. So this is what you want to do, especially if lifting things, even something as simple as taking a dish out of the dishwasher. Sometimes people throw their backs out doing that. So squeeze in, squeeze in, lift the pelvic floor. I'm going to give you one more instruction. Take your legs apart. We're going to pull these thighs up in towards the hip sockets. So if we bend down, pretend you're going to lift a heavy box, pull your thigh bones up towards your hips. Very nice. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze your booty. Excellent. All right, now pretend again with your feet turning forward, squeezing in, squeezing in, lifting, and pulling these thigh bones up. That's going to protect your knees too. So pretend you're going to lift something, push through your feet, lift, 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 squeeze that bum together. Excellent. So those are ways that you can do things around the house safely without hurting your back and your hips. Add that to any exercise that you're doing. Again, occupational things around the house, lifting things. And uh, if you have any questions, leave those in the comments. It's likely I'll get back to you with either a video or at least answer your question. Thanks again for tuning in and I will see you next time.